Hey everybody, welcome to my channel. If you're here for the first time, welcome. My name is Martina, and for my regular viewers, welcome back. I have exciting news today, guys. I have exciting news. Um, you, in case you guys don't know, I live in Tortola, British Virgin Islands, and we uh, were struck by Hurricane, uh, Hurricane Irma last year, September 2017. So basically, all these shops and everything were basically out of operation, out of business. And um, I got a text yesterday from the Little Switzerland store that um, has the Pandora store section in there. I got a text um, letting me know that um, they opened back their... Um, their store for business. Woohoo! The store was open back um, last week, Friday. Um, this Friday, gone June the 8th, right? And um, they open for business the Friday, um, Friday, Thursday, Fridays, and Saturdays. So, your girl went to the store yesterday. They opened on, on on Friday and I went to the store yesterday <laughs> I ready I was so excited I already had a list of stuff that I wanted to get and so I, when I went to the store I knew what I wanted to get so this is my purchase and basically this is my purchase for the year 2018 right I had more stuff that I wanted to get but um, as you know no store store no open market and you no know, get market the business they had limited items so I just got two pieces so this bag here this is one item that I want to show you well, what the lady told me, they didn't have any more of the boxes right now, the Pandora, the little Pandora boxes. So she gave me the bag. But we know, you know what these bags is like, basically like a cleaning cloth and it also protects your jewelry and stuff. And so she gave me that. This is my second bag like this. And so this is what I got. Hope you can see that. I think I'll do, try and do a close-up. This is my first um, safety chain ever. It has love on it. Where is it? What does that say? Uh... Does that say? Let me see. I know I told her to get. Oh, look like always. Yes. I'm a little clumsy this afternoon. Love always. I'll do a close up a little later on, right? So love always. So one side it says love, and the other side says always. Now this store is a authentic Pandora store, so I know I'm safe with that. I have or 10th authentic Pandora jewelry here right so I picked up this I can't remember the price what I'll do I'll just check my receipt again and uh, um, put, it, put it at the bottom of the screen so I got this one my first safety chain right and let me show what else I got now you guys know I always use I have a, a video about how to clean my Pandora jewelry and I, I will leave a, a card for that video in the top right hand part of the screen is very popular people have been using the tip and it's been working very well for them. But I decided to get a cleaning kit, kit that Pandora has. So this is it here. The box is so pretty. Look at that. So I got this. This is uh, $15 for this. I remember the price for this. I saw this same um, box on Amazon. It was selling for $25. I say, well, I thought to myself, that doesn't really make sense because when it comes to, I'll have to pay for shipping. And then two, I'll have to pay for when it gets to my my location, I have to pay for duties. So uh, it makes sense to go to the Pandora store here locally and just pay fifteen dollars, no additional charges. Makes sense, right? So enough talking. Let's see what's inside the box. I already opened it yesterday to see what this was here, right? And little, let me see if I can show you. Booklet. What's supposed to be inside of the box? And all the different instructions. This very informative book. Very informative. I have to go through this book again. A lot of it, good information and inside the box now let's hear what I was thinking right why does this box is so big and there's only these two pieces of item in here <laughs> thought it didn't make sense but as I said there's something has to be else in this box for this box to be so big anyway now this is a um, it's like a keychain right and this um, it has Pandora on it but but this is for basically to open the clasp Right, you just basically instead of using using your nails, you use this to open your um, the clasp for your for your bracelet, and you can use this as a keychain. Quite cute, I like it. And this is the brush when you're doing your cleaning. Here's my husband Dora side there. Just quite soft, but I think it's sturdy enough to do the to brush the um the charms and stuff. I'll give this a try. I'll, I'll do a review eventually with this eh, to let you know what I'll follow the instructions how to clean the Pandora jewelry and do a review on that too as well. So that'll be coming up. If I can do it in the same video, but um, I'll see how that goes. So underneath here there's more stuff. <laughs> there's more stuff. So what we have here we have um this is another 
Pandora bag, like what what I got the um, safety chain, safety safety chain with. This is one of them. I like the little um, pink rose gold, sort of pinkish, sort of a little ribbon that goes with it. And there's two in here. This one is black, All right? And it also has some cleaning cloth here, a black one, and a white one. So the bottom of the box was not empty. And that's it. I'm going to pack this back in here. Quite nifty. I like the box. And the book with the information goes up here. And the book also comes in different languages. Actually, no, I shouldn't say different languages, but it comes in, let me see, um, I think it's Spanish. Here it is. Spanish as, also, as well as in English. Yeah, that's Spanish. Cool. And the first page is basically showing you what's inside, what to expect inside the box. And we'll go through in detail how to use it. What it's saying in the book here is it was telling you exactly normal steps. Like for this part, for the, how you open your braces with the clips, it basically gives you instructions how normally you would open your, the clasp on your bracelet, like using your fingernails and stuff. And it's giving you instructions here how to use the um, clasp, the clasp opener that is provided in the box, how to use it. You know, it's quite very handy step by step you know how to store jewelry storage and things like that i really love this little book little book how it provides information so yeah so that's what i got my first haul for 2018 and um so i got the cleaning box sorry pandora cleaning jewelry box kit and i got my first safety chain so okay folks i've been having a really really hard time to try and focus get a close-up for this um the safety chain to get you to see exactly how the um the charm is looking at the end of each chain side of each chain but i'm having a hard time but i haven't given up i'll still try again before the end of this video to see if i can get a close-up um to see exactly what is for you to see what is marked it says love always as, as i mentioned before anyway so now i'm going to show you how to put on the charm safety charm sorry safety chain onto your bracelet so normally um let me just I'm showing you th two things today, how to put on the, the, um, the safety charm and how to use the um, clip that was provided in the, um, the cleaning kit. Okay, so I have the safety chain that I bought and the clip that came in the um, cleaning kit. Sorry, the clip that came in the cleaning kit, <laughs> right? So this is my bracelet. I'm going to show you exactly how I open it normally before I had the, um, the clip. So this is the... Um, clip here so normally you'll use like your nails to prise it between here to open this up okay this is what I've been doing so far okay so with the clip let me just remove this piece of plastic here that comes with it it's like a adhesive something so I could easily remove that okay so I'll use this end of the heart shape like and just prise in between here put it in between this slot here that I would normally put my use my fingernail just press in there and it's open I'm using the clasp opener to use to open to open, open one of to open this clip. As you can see, as I'm taking the charms off the bracelet, I'm just putting them in the same order that I had them on. So when I'm putting them back on, I know exactly I have them in the same order, the way I like it, you know. Now initially, um, I used I would say that I didn't really need a safety um, chain because. I make sure I put a, a charm like this that has a, a screws on at the end on both sides of the um, of the bracelet, so that basically secures my bracelet in my mind. But as you see previously, um, when I took off the um, when I opened the bracelet, the, the 
with the clasp, the bracelet just fell, fell on the counter. So with the chain on the bracelet, it, it would avoid that happening, you know? I just lost track of where these were, but I think I should be okay in that order. Yeah. So this is my last charm. This is the cruise ship. Okay, so this is my bracelet without anything on it. So the first thing I need to do is to put on the safety chain. Just put on one end, just screw on one end. Okay, so this one, this is one end of the um, safety safety chain on. This is the love side. No, this is always. <laughs> this is the always charm of the safety chain. So what I have to do now, put back on all the charms and then hook on the other side of the safety charms. I'll be back when I have done that. Okay, so I'm back. I have all the charms back onto the bracelets. So the next thing I'm going to do, the last thing I'm going to do just take the other end of the safety chain and just screw it on to this other end of the bracelet. You see that? Okay, I just put on the other side of the safety chain. As you can see here, this end of the chain is a bit tangled. So what I have to do is I'll just pull down this side of the safety chain, keep it down, and just try to twist out the chain the other direction, and it will just twist out. If you don't keep down the other side of the safety chain, it will come off. Just keep it down like this. Arr. Okay, so I have it down here, and you can see the chain is a bit twisted, so I'll just twist like this. And it's clear now. So I could put my um, bracelet onto my hands now. Hmm. This is a bit tight. But for sure, this would not fall off my hand when I open my bracelet. Anyway, let me just hook this quickly. Okay, so here's my bracelet with the safety chain on. My bracelet fits quite snug, so you know, there's no dangle sort of effect on it with it. So let me show you how to take off the bracelet with it on your hand using the clasp opener. So basically using one hand to open the um, bracelet. Just put it in the slot in between there. So it's not that bad. And you notice right away when I open the bracelet, it doesn't fall off like how it would fall off normally without the um, safety chain. So that's a big help for me. But it's a, it's a little tight on my wrist because my bracelet has a lot of stuff on it. And you know, so, but it's quite nice. Okay, let me see if I got a close up for you for right now with the, that's the love upside it down <laughs> and this is the always side always this is the love side okay guys i hope you enjoyed this video click on the thumbs up button Leave a comment for me and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. And don't forget to click on the notification bell next to the subscribe button. In doing so, you'll get a notification each time I upload a new video. Okay, thanks so much for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.